Hello everyone. Happy greetings. My warm wishes for happy International Women's Day. I am Archana Bajpay, an astrologer and a motivational speaker. Thank you so much for inviting me as a guest speaker for this event. I am very grateful. I truly appreciate your invitation. Thanks for inviting. I run a YouTube channel named as Astro Talkies which has 100k subscriber where I do astro consultations and guide my community. So now you may be curious about how I achieved 100k subscribers without any collaboration and you may be happy to know that my channel has 100% organic growth. If you ask from me how I achieved it, I will just say I work on my feminine energy, which is also known as Istri Shakti or Nari Shakti, Mahila Shakti. So, feminine energy is a special power, a natural gift of God. And by using it, I did it. I am very happy about doing my jobs very well giving motivation to everyone i do participate in spiritual practice beside this i also do gym to fit myself it boosts my energy i love to play games love to cook food and love to take care of my family family is very important for me i am also interested in starting online astro classes very soon for my goals what i do so what i do i am always very regular i am not distracted i am dedicated i stay motivated for my goals i learn from my mistakes as well as mistakes of others too i assess myself whether i am right or wrong I have a strong will to overcome and I don't give up easily and sometimes when broken I collect myself again and pour into my goal thus slowly I get my desired results and finally all goes well today I am thrilled to be here to inspire and uplift each and every one of you as we celebrate the remarkable achievement and spirit of women around the world. It is a day to acknowledge their spirit, strength and unwavering commitment to shaping a better future for all. So always remember, destruction should not be in your life. Always stay motivated. Do your job with determination. Value your time. Don't give up halfway. Learn with your mistakes. Talk to yourself. Assessment of self is very important. And be true to yourself. So these are some key points. You can work on it. Actually, we all have this energy, but we don't analyze ourselves. Whenever you follow your projects, just think and these energies, you will get your ways. Every six months, analyze yourself. Then you will see a huge transformation in you. The Sanskrit saying from Manu Smriti, Yatra Pujante Nari, Tatra Ramyanate Devata. What does this Sanskrit line mean? It means that the gods are in high spirit where women by Istri Shakti is worshipped. Sanskrit line clearly says the truth that where women are respected, are valued and given equal opportunities, society thrives and harmony prevails. It is a recognition that the divine resides within us and every woman 
that by honoring them we honor the very essence of humanity while studying astrology came to know that the how universe helps in growing all the nine planets the sun moon mars mercury jupiter venus saturn uh, along with rahu and ketu have their own role in our lives the fire which is the light which comes from the sun will give light to the world without fire one cannot survive can you imagine your life without fire so fire is very important for any shape if you want to design yourself then fire is very important the mother care which comes from the moon will give love to the world the courage which comes from mars will handle the tough situations the intellect which comes from mercury will bring out from your hard uh, situations or hard uh, uh, your days so believe in your intellect the gurus advisor which comes from jupiter will show you the right path so always follow your advisor the healthy relations which comes from venus will make you happy and build your community the service with devotion and discipline which comes from saturn is always welcome everywhere the obsessiveness which comes from rahu can make you crazy about the things and this is a uh, disorder and it will imbalance your life the liberation which comes from ketu one of this can make you lazy this is also a disorder so these are the real facts we have to work on it throughout the history women have played worst style roles as mothers sisters daughters leaders engineers doctors researchers and many more jobs they have been the architect of change the bearers of culture and the nurturers of society that is why in bharat when people greet each other they say sita ram radha krishna or lakshmi narayan yeah you will find that the feminine energy comes first sita is a feminine energy after that rama comes likewise radha is a feminine energy after that krishna comes so in the past this was the culture in our society nowadays it is missing but by remembering international women's day every year we come to our roots one thing i would like to share my thoughts on uh, gender equality because actually it is not true gender equality will never work this is a misleading word it should be gender clarity please note i can make you understand by an example let us take a mango fruit it has its own kind of taste shape size and nature and let us take uh, any fruit like grapes papaya pomegranate or any other uh, fruit whatever you want you can take it so they cannot be the same as mango all are very different in taste shape size and nature so how can they be equal likewise men and women both have different nature different kind of quality men have to do different kind of work and women have to do different kind of work so inbuilt work is very different in men and women so just focus on your inbuilt character that nature has given us we can also take some inspiration from indra noi former ceo of pepsico marigom olympic boxer sudha murthy renowned personality and chairperson of infosys the great author their contribution to society can't be ignored so what do you think 
how did they get their desired results definitely they focus on energies by which they got their results so points to be remembered are always be strong fix to your decisions always have purpose value your time focus on time management be cheerful stay happy be thoughtful like mothers be a warrior if anything negative is going just kick out the negative things develop the ability to see clear picture and thus you get the perfection so these are some points by which you can achieve your goals to the women present here today i want to express my deepest respect and appreciation for your strength your determination your spirit to the women who inspire us every day our mothers sisters daughters colleagues and friends we salute your spirit once again i extend my warmest welcome to each of you and i thank you for joining us in celebrating this important occasion thank you very much have nice time happy international women's day thank you